I'm 18 kilometers uh, from my destination. I don't, I don't want to go further. I mean, uh, my last for this attempt was uh, 54.5. So if I get to 55 plus, I'm, I'll be happy. I don't need to do any more. So next time I can do a little bit higher. So that's sometimes my game to myself. Um, I got lost a little because um, I I wasn't focused on directions again. Uh, I, I passed by an area where there's lots of KTVs, not not KTVs. Uh, I mean massage, same thing basically. Um, I thought there was more KTV, but there's a lot of massage here now. I, I don't know what city this is. This is still uh, quite a bit quite a bit away from the tourist area, Mune. But uh, I passed by an area of the town where it looks like there's a lot of banks, at least three different banks. One big one and a few different, two different, two or three different ATMs. And of course, where there's ATMs, you know you can spend some money. Of course, there's some massage, like over the top massage. I was gonna lean into like, oh, come on. We all know what makes money. Like women makes money. Because men thinks without dicks, right? So, uh, I'm sorry, man. I, I, I'm not young anymore. I, I sort of understand what what's the economy is based on. I don't want to say sex sells. Sex is the economy. That's really it. Like, like come on. You look at this place. You look at the world. What, you, you buy fancy cars. You buy expensive bags. I go, yeah. Without this shit, what, are you going to be Mao and... Make everybody wear the same gray green shirt. Men and women, no man. Women helps the economy grow. Anyway, I uh, I got lost a little bit because um, right across the biggest massage shop, like seven story or t over ten story high massage shop, right across the street there's a English uh, class, English like learn English. I don't want to bring Jason into it. Jason's actually an English teacher. But all his girlfriends don't speak English. Like he's smart, man. I I, still, I want to bring bring up this point. And I hope my Lao girlfriend in Pattaya is not watching this video because if you are, look, I've been to Laos before. I don't like it. The food is expensive. I remember one time the girls, like I was so. This story was so interesting to me because when the girls see their daughter or their kids learning english they go no don't don't let the kid learn english it's like in my mind i go why don't you want to learn your kids to learn english maybe they'll become prostitutes once they learn english because they all know the local locally the men don't have enough money they know foreigners have cash uh, i go they don't want their kids to be prostitutes uh, Okay, I'm sure my Lao girlfriend Patai is gonna correct me because uh, her English is so perfect and she's young. Maybe she hasn't find that idiot blonde guy that never seen an Asian woman before and it falls head over toe over her. And then unfortunately she met me and oh man, she screwed down. Anyway, she know my program. I told her you can make as much money as I as you can possibly make. I have this like a uh, salary cap. <laughs> Once you make enough, you have to, uh, you have to, you have to share it because I'm sort of like uh, I'm from Canada, so I'm, and I'm Chinese. I'm naturally a socialist. So I'm sorry, girl. I go, you ain't getting a million from me. Most you're getting is this much, and then if you can make more on yourself, go for it. This is your. Uh, your investment capital is like, oh, here's a, here's a lump sum. You can gamble it away all you can. But honestly, girl, I don't trust women that speaks perfect English anymore. You can check with Jason. <laughs> Jason, you've been watching. You probably understand me now better. I'm not that new to the game. <laughs> I'm sort of closer to the game over stage, but I go, yep. Yeah. Oh, that's that's where I'm leaving. Let's cut it short so I can post this video without using all of my memory again. Uh, pharmacy. Yeah, I checked pharmacy here. They don't have the uh, World War II uh, vitamin I'm looking for. The girl sort of gave me an angry look. In a strange way, Google part knows me. 
a lot better. Oh, I, I want to mention my last to- post about dogs. I really am talking about dogs, but somehow my keyboard won't let me type. Oh, wow, it's almost like a, the government are censoring what I think now because I cannot voice. I really am looking at the dogs. You come here and look at the dogs itself. I'm not talking people, I'm just talking to dogs. You gotta understand dogs or just dogs really well when you look at dogs. Anyway, I uh, gotta go because uh, I still have 18 kilometers left and my battery life is 33%. When it gets to under 10%, I'm gonna get it charged. Unlike yesterday where I'm in a like remote with no street lights, you know, car can easily, a truck can easily hit me. Here, I'm, uh, I feel really confident that uh, nothing can uh, really happen to me, but let's see what they're watching. Anyway, see you guys later. Uh, yeah, I love, I love big city because I honestly, if I'm walking through a big city, I, don't, I almost don't need to sleep. I go, if I'm tired, I was just like, oh, where's the bed? Uh, right now, I almost felt like oh, I've been so rejuvenated at the blind shop that uh, I can last forever. Okay, see you guys later. Bye-bye.